welcome back again so today we are going to do skincare i'm going to show you guys how to take care of your face and um before we start i want to say if you don't have a skincare routine yet uh this is a beginner skincare because it's very simple and uh, very effective and simple skincare routine it's good because you can adhere to it it is not going to exhaust you so it's a thing that you can do in the morning in the evening the day after you know with consistency because consistency is key you want to program your skin into a routine that you're going to be consistent to and you're going you know you want to tell your skin this is what we do and you're not going to do me bad and i won't do you bad so right now i'm from the shower and um, that's the kind of skin that you it's good to exfoliate because today i feel like exfoliating uh, so what i do i start with a with a cleansing foam it's a cleanser it's of garnier and this is what i use on a daily morning and evening and it's so good it's very easy to to use and again before you start anything on your skin you want to make sure that it is cleaned no you don't want to get in there and get bacteria moving left right and center no so it's in a paste form and i use this thing like it's like a silicone sponge most of, almost running out so you just need that much and that is even a lot you just need like a pea size and then no oh, i'm just wetting it with some water because my face is already wet maybe you can't see it but i'm from the shower so it's good so with this you just cleanse 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 You can, if you don't have this, of course, you can use your, what you use to wash your face normally. Scrub in circular motions. Circular, circular motion. Circular upwards motion. Whatever you want to do to your face, you are also supposed to do it on your neck. So now it's time to clean it to wash that off. Pack that dry with your clean towel, of course. But you're not going to dry it kabisa because now it's time to exfoliate. I just use the normal scrub. <laughs> you can get this from anywhere. I swear anywhere. I even saw it in Ushago, so... This thing is everywhere. I don't think it adds anything to the skin, but it does the job because we just want to, you know, get rid of the dead skin. And for me, it works. That's how it looks like. It has fine, fine particles. And that is what you're going to just get into your skin and get the dead skin off. Because imagine if you just have a layer of dead skin that is on your skin, blood in your skin, you know, mm -mm. you want your skin to be rejuvenated every day, creating new cells, younger cells, you know, that's what brings in the, mm. so also with the exfoliation, we do circular motions and going up. So it's circular upward motions it's like you're giving yourself a facelift you don't want to drag your skin like this is a no mm -mm, we don't do that circular upwards you know and with the skin there is no rush just take your time it's even enjoyable because right now I'm feeling like, uh, you know, the massage is getting in. Don't forget your neck. 
and with net that's where you really want to go upwards you don't want to you know time for wrinkles is coming just don't hasten it <laughs> don't come down when you go up when it gets like that it's like you are out of the scrub that's how you know you're doing it let's do, let's wash this off So scrub is rinsed, let's pat that dry. So about scrubbing, you don't need to scrub every day. Uh, personally, I do it once, twice a week, and twice a week, depending on if I feel like my skin is dry and just in need of a scrub but once a week is just perfect but we are different if your skin can tolerate more times it's good because i had scrub on my face and i want to mask for me i always feel like i just go there and get anything that maybe was not very cleaned before I go in with the scrub, because with the, sorry, before I go in with the mask, because with the mask, your pores are going to be sucking in what is in your skin. So for me, I'm just very keen. I want some, this is my cotton ball. And I'll just, you know, stretch that out like so to have a bigger surface of course to work with and right at this moment i'm going to use garnier uh the micellar water with vitamin c to just go through my face and maybe get anything that is still there and if you just getting started with your skincare you can uh, use this as a cleanser as well of course it is a cleanser you're going to you can use this as a cleanser but i would really really recommend for you to start with the forming cleanse i think it's just very moisturizing it leaves your skin very moisturized as compared to this so with the micellar water you just want to wipe that on your skin just wipe white again upward motions don't drag your skin down avoid dragging your skin down because this is like giving your skin a facelift imagine you're doing like this all the time morning and evening or whenever you want for 10 years you're saving your skin that's a trick there I don't know if you can see that There's something, it has cooked out something. So right now I'm ready to go in with my mask and I'm going to use the, this looks like a sponsorship video, but to tell you the truth, these Ghana products, they have really, really saved me. And uh, what I started with, I actually started with this. It worked well. I went for the serum. We, are, we will get there. And I just built my whole skincare around their products because they've done me good and I'm such a loyal person and uh, I just love to stick in to things that they've done me good. I don't want to try, then something backfires, then I'm back to the drawing board. That's not me. I don't have the patience to see if this thing will work or not. I just want to stick to what I know will work. 
so if you also have products that work for you sorry i didn't show you that but this is how the paste comes out of course it's black and uh it has a very good feeling to the skin you know it's very relaxing because it has that community feel so this one we're just going to paste our skin with it with this i will tell you just do a thin layer on your skin because it will still work and uh we're going to leave this one on for like um actually until you feel like it's dry because your skin is going to absorb all that good in it so till you feel like it's dry then we'll come and rinse off now this is dry you can see that it is dry we're going to rinse it off Pat that dry and I've rinsed that with cold water because now you know cold water just helps with your skin because it's going to tighten your pores and uh, I see people with open pores and you know large pores and I go like mm -mm, I'll just try to do whatever to prevent that because I don't want it And again, when you're drying your skin, don't drag it. Just pat it. It will be dry. Don't attack with four seashells. It will be okay. This, this mask, you can use it as a wash. As, you know, the same way we've used this. You can use this as a wash. You can also use it as a scrub because it has fine particles, rough particles. But for me, I find them not rough enough and but if you have very delicate skin the 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 finer particles for you in this will be enough and then again it's a mask and with my skin it says it will absorb excess sebum and neutralize shine i'm sure you want that too mm. now it's time to turn and I'm just going to pick a cotton ball like that. And I'm almost out. You can use the toner that you want. Even rose water. If you have rose water, it's a good toner. Like in the, for me, I use this one, the, the lemon one. And make sure your toner is alcohol free. Because alcohol is a dehydrant and it's going to steal moisture from your skin. And we don't want that because what we want with our skin is, uh, you know, plumness. And that is only achieved by making sure that it is well moisturized. Because that's what gives us the young look that we're trying to achieve here. So you turn, turn, turn. Turning is just, you know, you, you've been doing a lot with your skin. You've washed it, you've scrubbed it, you've masked it. So you just want to bring it back to normal. Like to turn down that craziness. We get to what goes into our skin now for me i really love and let me tell you this i'll tell you this kindly 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 look for a serum that you love and that your skin is going to love because serum is like food to your skin it's what nourishes the skin better. 
it is what will make your skin feel supple it is what will just make your skin look dewy glowy rich with of course you know and just firm so for me i go again with ganya i told you i found ganya and i just stuck to them and uh, maybe I might. I've also used Mary Kay, the night cream. It also does good. But now I just don't know where to get the original one from. But if I get it, I'll come back here and show you. So I love this thing. It it also has vitamin C in it. It's a serum, and uh, I love how a small one goes all the way. I just need. Uh, a pump like that, oh, it's true clean down, you know, and run it. You know, like so. To the neck. It goes to the neck, like that. We just go in with it. So this is what I do. Apply that on. Make sure that it is just not sitting in your skin, but it is well absorbed. Can you see that? Hey, can you see that? Now it's time for my cream and when like right now because the the temperatures are high a little I just love going in with some cream just a little like that so that I would my face won't go very oily Garnier again it's the uh, even and matte vitamin c cream and i love how their their products have vitamin c because vitamin c is good for your skin it evens out your skin you know you don't have you don't want to to have patches like your skin is not uniform maybe your neck is some other color your cheeks are some other color so i love this one i love this i love this a lot the vitamin c ingredients in their products so that much this is like a piece size or less and you go very little this cream is matte will leave your skin with the matte finish but again it's moisturizing it's not dry on your skin oh, no no so so Ile kushine shiny meisha because you don't want to step out looking like you just had some good scoop of Vaseline and walked out. You see, that's a matte look, and um, it's going to stay like that for a while, which is good. And then after that, of course, of course, don't forget your sunscreen it's time for sunscreen don't forget your sunscreen that uh that is a cpf 30. don't forget your sunscreen because number one aging property is the sun and for me i always go with a very thin layer of that kama busta kipia sura yangu ika imekauka sana i love some paglo and at this point skin care routine is complete for me i'll just go do you know kidogo ka lip gloss and i'm ready to go out this is how you'll meet me on the street. So that is at the end of our skincare routine. If you don't have one yet, you can do as simple as the cleansing form once a week. 
the scrub and I'll urge you kindly get yourself a serum get yourself a serum these I'll say these are the main main actually you can do a skincare routine with these three and you'll just fine you'll just be fine from here now you can build up your skincare routine to even nine steps if you so wish bye